Howdy guys, how are we doing? Welcome back to another video of Westland Survival. How are we doing? Hope you guys are well. We are continuing our cave run of the Spirit Cave in hard mode enchantment 2. Yes, not the greatest of enchantments, but it's hard mode nonetheless. So basically, if you guys haven't watched um, the first video, go ahead and check that out. So I'll sort of provide why, the reasoning why behind it. But essentially, I wanted to do a, basically a last run with you guys. And um, now that the Spirit Cave is shutting down for some time, we just don't know when that's going to reopen. Um, I thought it'd be a good time, as well as any good time, to run through the cave and see what we get from it. Because I'll be interested to see. Because like I haven't really done uh, too much of hard mode with the Spirit Cave, let alone going up the enchantment tree, so to speak. And just interested to see what type of um, you know what type of rewards and things like that we get and how good are the weapons and clothing and things like that are so yeah that's um that's my thing that's my thing that i really wanted to sort of have a look at and um yeah i did mention in the previous um video but i want to um highlight it here again because we're actually here i'd love to see this is locked i'd love to see this be av made available to us at some point not sure if it ever was or if it ever is it like i said i just hadn't been able to um you know, I just haven't put any sort of um, focus on um, running the caves as much as I probably should have been because I've been prioritizing other things and that, I guess that's the reason for that. So, yeah, but since the cave is shutting down, we really want to speculate and see what is actually going to happen with these caves and how is it going to change and how much of it is going to, is it going to change. I mean, going by what the developers have said, it's a major rework. It's a huge major rework. It's never been done before in the game's um, incarnation, incarnation especially um, of the, the Spirit Cave. So I'd love to see what is going to happen to it. And I'd love to sort of see what the um, the end result is going to be, you know? So yeah, that's um, that's my thing about it. So really, 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 really interested. It's, it's obviously, it's piqued my interest, uh, you know? So just to sort of give you guys a, a quick recap on that, um, it will become non-available and, and, and inaccessible to all players when update 5.3 rolls around, which we've already been told by the developers, it's going to be the next update. So we're currently sitting at 5.2.1, I believe it is. So 5.3 is going to be the cutoff update for this Spirit Cave. It's not going to be accessible. I would imagine it's still going to be on the map, um, we're just not allowed to go to it. I don't know whether or not if it's going to have some sort of barriers or something of that nature. I don't know. I honestly don't know. But that is the ins and outs of it. As much as we know right now, because we really don't know much else about it. That's it. And that's the honest truth. We just don't know what else about it. So, you know, um, <coughs> excuse me. At this point in time, it's all speculation. And you guys know how I, how much I love to speculate things. So, um, but I will leave it to you guys as well. And I want you guys to let me know what you think is going to happen with this Spirit Cave. Where you think it's going to end up. How is it going to, you know, measure back in to the game? And how are we as players going to, um, you know, circle back to it? How are we going to adapt, to adapt it back into our gaming life and... Will it be something that's going to be worth our while coming back into on a regular basis when the uh, Spirit Cave is um, made available to us again? So every time that you <coughs> currently, sorry, um, every time that we go into the Spirit Cave, there's always a cooldown. So whether or not the cooldown is going to continue, um, will it become a um, a thing as such that we um, have to wait for cooldowns, or can we just repeatedly reactivate it with um, certain totems or certain things I don't know but that's just something that I'm just been thinking about you know in the background myself well right, let's take out this uh, mature piazza there we go nice and easy All right, well, well let's see what we get out of these I'm getting a fair bit of fur, which is actually really nice, because... <coughs> Excuse me. Whew, that was a big one. Yeah, so like I said, 
getting a lot of fur out of this um, out of this deal, so I'm pretty happy with that outcome. Yes, at the expense of using other better weapons and equipment and things like that, but nonetheless, I'm pretty happy with what I've got so far. So, so far, so good. So far, so good. Alrighty, let's um, sneak up on this fellow and sneak up on this fellow. And I don't know whether or not if we're in the mid section of this. I have no clue. No clue at all. Alright, let's just go over this way. And uh, take this fella out from here. There we go. One shot. One shot again. Yeah, so doing quite well here. There's no other little spots down there. Um... Okay, let's just go ahead and open up this. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, let's just take out this fella here. Ah, yes, I remember this spot here. So there's all these little, um, these little cavities down here. So if you really wanted to, you could always go down here and um, take these fellas out. But honestly speaking, I'm not going to bore you with these guys and just taking all these fellas out. I might end up doing it just for my own personal satisfaction, but um, I'll do that off cam as I'm going along. So what I'll probably end up doing is, I think you guys get it from this point of view. So I'm going to continue continue on and I'm going to take out the rest of these fellas here and I'll bring it back in once I'm ready for the boss man. Alrighty, here we go guys, we are going to take down the big fella here, so let's go ahead and just see if we can take out the little the little fellas first, before we take out the big boy, because the big boy is going to be the big boy. Alright, here comes my bear, took, took him ages, mate, you need to be a little bit quicker for me. Alright, let's do this, the primal Piazza. The primal Piazza. Look at you. All primal like. Alright, come on, bear. You gotta do something. Come on, bear. Distract him, bear. You need to distract. That's right, we got him. We got him. And what did you drop for me, mate? What did you drop? Okay, so you dropped one of those. Another enchantment three. And there you go. Like I said, I think they've changed it. They must have changed it. The fact that we, um,. Uh, what do you call it? That we get full, um, full uh, tablets. I'll, I'll call them tablets. What are they? The seal. The seal of spirits. Normally, you get the fragments and pieces. So, I don't know what's going to happen with that either. Will they go away? Will that be a thing? Come the new update when the spirit cave is back online again? I don't know. I would love to know that. And the other thing I would like to know, and what hasn't actually been disclosed, and I feel like the developers should actually um, disclose this information as well, like, are the tablets going to be usable in the next update? And if not, should we be using these up as we go along? That's what I would like to know. Now, I've defeated everything here. Oh, no, I didn't actually get you guys. Come here, you guys. I thought I got you guys, but I didn't. Come here. Let's take you out. And you too. There we go. Um, yeah, so I didn't actually... I haven't... Oh, no, I want that. Um, I want to equip that. That's what I wanted to do. Um, yeah, so we don't know exactly... Should we be using all of our stuff up? And and if, we, if not, then... Yeah, do we need to hang on to them? So, yeah, that really really hasn't been communicated to us so I'm a little bit concerned about that so I don't want to sort of go in wait and not do anything um, and and if we do do that what's gonna happen do we lose it or do they become incompatible with the new update once that happens that is the question I would like to know and I'll, hopefully the developers would actually address and ask and answer that question um, but if they do end up doing that, I don't want them to leave it too late, so to speak. That's what I don't want to happen, because that's going to be really, really disappointing, and for a lot of players. And we want to ensure that we're getting the most out of this game, especially when a a, um, a portion of the game is going to be, you know, taken away from us for a certain period of time. So, 
that's something I would actually like to know. And if they could tell us, that'd be helpful. That would be helpful. All right, so Cave 3 is done and dusted, boys and girls. So we're going to be heading into um, Cave 4 momentarily. But I'd love to drop a few things off um, before we get uh, stuck into it, of course. So what am I going to drop off? Probably end up dropping that off. Let's just eat that. And yeah, I think that's pretty good good for now and I feel like I don't know if that's going to last me all the way through I don't know whether or not should I take the last gun we'll see how we go I feel like I've got enough firepower for this but you know always famous last words we'll see how we go with this of course alright let's go with this Okay, Ooh, one shot, I like that. Two, three shots. And three shots, well two shots, sorry. Um, okay, so let's take that, let's take that. And we're back to full health now, which is very nice. Two, all right, keep two-shotting. Ah, uh, gotta do the two shots, has to be two shot. But, all right, let's just take those with us. Yeah, so, as I've been going along as well, I haven't been taking everything, everything. Just things that I find that might be useful for me. Um, but otherwise, yeah, everything else has just been, you know, left, I guess. Because I don't really need it. They're all basic stuff, and that's what I'm hoping for um, come the new update. Will it be a scaling thing? The, the harder of modes that you go, um, the different in... Um, rewards that you will receive that's what I'd love to see um, I'd like to see that just so it will incentivize um, you know uh, end the game players to actually conduct the um, uh, the spirit cave or whenever the new spirit cave whatever that looks like comes to light but they could always do away with that as well see we might not even get um, the enchantment system you know, difficulty of levels and whatnot, that might not be a thing in the new world of the game. So, that's another thing to consider. I didn't even think about that up until now, really. Um, but yeah, be interested to see how that sort of um, pans out. Oop, thought I shot you. But yeah, like, it, it might not be a thing later on. We just don't know. But so far, I've been able to run this with barely usage of all of my uh, my heals. So I actually stocked up on a lot of heals, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, that's um, interesting for me. And as you can see, I'm actually getting a neat little return on stuff as well. Not oh, totem depleted. Okay. Okay. Can we go through? Can we shoot you? Yes, we can. And I'd like to find the first mini boss at this point. Let's just pop you back there. Getting a lot of empty um, water skins as well, so if you really wanted to get water skins, good place to come to, because I would have had a couple of stacks by now, and I would imagine it would be the same if you just didn't do hard mode, if you just did the easy mode side of things. Oops. Yeah, I reckon that would would be the case. Okay, and there goes another stack. A lot of fur actually. Just keep giving me the fur. I should be taking those um those cottons. I know there's ones and twos and stuff like that, but you know how it is. You know how it is guys, it's just difficult to take everything. There we go. Okay, so this room is clear and I think yes we go up this way to uh, continue on. So what I might do is I will continue on my merry way in clearing out this joint and then I guess we'll see you guys for the final battle so I'll bring you back in very soon okay guys we're back so I think we're nearly at the end here as we sort of trundle our way down the little cave ski over here I think this is it yes it is this is where the big fella should be the last big fella 
Um, let's just sneak away. There he is. He's there. He's there. Alright, well, while we're here, may as well just loot this while we've got it. And uh, let's see what we get from it. Okay, a couple of bits and pieces. Now, I should have enough firepower. There's a red door here too. Oh, that's the exit, I think. I think that is to exit. Let's see if we can just work our way through these fellas. And there's another red door. See, I wonder if that opens if we take out this fella. Will it now? I don't know. But anyway, let's go ahead and do it. You're thirsty. Of course you're thirsty. Just before I get into battle here. Um, let's, well, on that, let's just quickly heal up. There we go. Alright. Let's do it. Oh, that was a bit of a... Again, in succession. Oh my goodness. Alright, stop, dude. You're just taking out all, all of my allies. Really? Really? You know what? I'm going to absolutely take you out before you take me out. And that broke my weapon. And I actually survived on one um, set of clothing, believe it or not. There you go. Happy with that. So you are done. That's another ch enchantment three. Now I've got nine of the buggers. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to, um, yeah, I'm going to have to use them up or use some of them up actually just see if I can get to enchantment fours and fives and what have you but that's it that's everyone then I've and I've cleaned everyone I've gutted the whole place the all four caves as well by the way so we've done all of that okay what do we get so 298s um, I don't think I saved one of those so I'm going to take one of those with me let's just use one of those and let's open up this one and see what we get from it um, okay, cool. And the last chest. This one takes forever though. This one takes a long time to open up. There we go. There we go. And we got some of that stuff. So we got a, um, a tube out of the deal, which is okay. And then we've got a tribal bow, which is 252 damage, 110 in durability, which is not too bad. Like, I just love to see some of these things would have a high durability. Ooh, can we access that now? I wonder what's in there. Because that was red. And so was that. I wonder what's over here. I think this takes you back to the start, but you have to... I think you need a... Um, I think I'm a doodle. I think you need a an axe in order for you to... Um, Oh, not an axe, sorry. A pickaxe. What am I saying? Because there's a blockage over here. I'm sure of it. Um, Alright, let's just take those. And yes, there's our said blockage. Okay. At least we know. We know. So that must be the exit door then. That would be the exit door. For sure. Alright, well, we may as well get out of here then. Because there's really nothing else for us to do here. Absolutely smashed it. There we go. And that is it. All four caves. Comprehensively done. Now, I'm interested to see, now that we've gone through all four caves, do the other ones open up? I'd love to know. So, hang with me here for a sec, guys. I'd love to see if we can um, unearth this. Because it's over this way, yes? Yeah. It still says locked. So, I don't know what needs to happen in order for us to unlock those things because I know there's one in cave 2 but do you have to do that first I honestly don't know and from memory it's all it's buried somewhere but for argument's sake while I've got you guys here I may as well just show you I know we might go a little bit long in this video but at least you guys get to hear my voice for a little bit more but yeah, I mean, I really want to know. Like, I'm really, really curious. So, we go up this way, I think. And then we head all the way down this way. I'm pretty sure this is it. It is... No, it's not. It is most definitely not. <laughs> there you go. Uh, there you go. So, whether or not if, if it's over this way, we've got to go up a little bit further. 
we might have to go up a bit further. So I know you got to bank a left. You definitely have to hang a left somewhere. Was it down this way? Oh, it might be down this way. Hopefully. Hopefully. I don't want to be made alive from you, to you guys. Definitely not. I think it is. Yeah, see, it's still red. And you still can't interact with it. You can see the glow. So, yeah, I, don't, I just don't know what the requirements are. And again, it's something that's never been discussed broadly. So, I'm assuming that no, nobody knows. And it's just one of those things that we just don't know. And it's just one of those things that are locked away for eternity. And never was meant to be or systematically there may have just been placeholders for something if the developers thought about implementing something to those um to those red gates i don't know i feel like they may, they may have added something to it or they may have done something to the spirit caves as like a an incremental update potentially but who knows who knows what i do know is I've got a whole bunch of these things, and I would very much like to um, do the tribute thing in my jiggies. So let's go ahead and do that. So that's one. And do I have five of those? I don't think I have five of those actually. Not not with me though. There we go. So at least we can just open up two of them while while I've got you guys here and see what we get out of the deal well we've got some basic stuff like the jackets and stuff like that I'll probably end up leaving the fur I'm definitely going to take I mean while we're at it I may as well um, start healing and, and things like that but for sure and we've got one of these bone spear bad boy things and I'll take some of these things for sure but curious to see what we get in the um, in the third one Okay, so you got more basic things as well. Um, healing wise, can I? No. Right, let's just open up this and let's just open up this. Cool. And we got a few of these things, so yeah, not, not bad. Not bad. So I'll definitely have to come back in and out and. Um, and uh, what do you call it? Yeah, so I've only got four in pockets and one on my order, so I can potentially open that. Actually, I can open that. Um, but look, I think I've taken up too much of your time and I think I'm going to go ahead and leave it here for this video, but I'm definitely going to try and um, take out the, um, the spirit cave as much as I possibly can and eventually get to the highest spirit level that I can possibly undertake and then thereafter. We'll, we'll just see what happens guys we'll just see what happens but I appreciate you guys stopping by and checking out the video as always let me know what you think about what your thoughts are going to be for uh, the spirit cave itself and does it line with with line up with what I think or do you have your own what um, thinking and you know thoughts about this and yeah just let me know let me know but that's it guys i appreciate you guys stopping by checking out the video please leave a like comment down below share if you can and if you guys are new to the channel or not and you want to see more be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos all right guys take it easy and i'll catch you guys in the next one